What's up guys? So the other week I made a video of transforming my garden into a professional football pitch. You guys loved it it's the first video that I've made on my new channel that's passed a million views and I've got you guys to thank for that and since that video went out so many of you have been asking me to make a video of actually using the football pitch in the garden so that's exactly what I'm gonna do but before I make that video I thought let's order some of the best training equipment on the market and incorporate that into the garden so that you've not just got an astroturf pitch with a goal you've actually got the sickest training equipment too so that's what i've done you can see the boxes behind me this is over a thousand pounds worth of training equipment the goal cost about two thousand pounds the net behind it was about 500 so that's two and a half grand and then this brings it up to about three and a half grand maybe even a bit more so before i use it i've got to unbox it so i thought why not make a video showing the process of unboxing everything that you've got to be honest i ordered it all a few weeks ago so i can't even remember everything that's in the boxes so this is going to be a bit of a surprise to me as well because i literally can't remember what i ordered what's in these boxes so it's going to be an unboxing for me as i do it as well as you guys to watch it so let's get into it and see what we've got okay so first things first this is one of the smaller boxes let's see what is inside here Aye. Yeah, boy. So these are just like super-sized cones for dribbling in and out of. They look really good on camera. You can do so many different drills with them. And I've never actually owned cones like this. So that's box number one, open. Let's move on to the next. I've got my sister here as well to help me. We've got a video coming out soon. Don't worry, don't worry about that. Charlotte is a baller. You guys don't even know. I don't even want to give it away, Charlotte, because when the video drops, you guys are going to be amazed by what this girl is capable of with the football. No pressure. <laughs> oh, Maxi is coming out to help. Hello, boy, you coming out to help? You coming out to help? You gonna help us unbox? Okay, next one. This is more cones. I'll tell you what, when it comes to football training, you can't have enough cones. This one's the heaviest one. <gasps> oh gosh. That is, that is proper heavy, though. I don't know what's gonna be in there. Maybe it's like a weight that holds something. It's a lot of the same thing, I think. But what is oh, it? Oh yeah, is, is that, say, a base? What is this? Don't give it away. Oh. <laughs> yes, um. this is the base. Ah, I know what this is going to be for. This base is going to be for poles. These are poles that are used for dribbling and also you can, you can use it for loads of things, but dribbling in and out of agility work, even bending a ball around it into the top corner, you can use these for. So all of the bases come with one of these things. And then that goes in the base and we've got our pole. I think that makes it more sturdy than the usual. Sick. Okay, let's pull it out. Oh, those are these are nice. These are lovely. They're so bright. They're so yeah. nice. That's my favourite thing about these goals, the colour. So these are little mini goals, but they're brilliant because they're so easy to pack down, they're portable, they look so cool. Wow. Literally mm -hmm. just open that out. You can see that just goes into there. Done. It's literally that simple. Wow. Straight out of the pack, open it out, bang. You've got a mini goal, it looks fantastic. Okay, next up, we're tackling the big one. This is the longest. Here we go. Oh yeah, boy. Can you see what these are? Mannequins. I've always wanted my own mannequins, and now I've Finally got them. This is going to be amazing for doing free kicks in the garden. So there's three mannequins there. One, two, and three. Boom. I've always wanted that. Even when I was a kid, I would have loved to have had mannequins. Didn't have the space, didn't have the money, and yeah, just didn't have any mannequins ever. So, <laughs> next up. I've got no idea what's inside it. Is it heavy? Nah, it's light. Hmm. I probably should have used scissors instead of a knife, but... Don't try this at home. That's the same oh. job, isn't it? Interesting. Can you see what's in there? Yeah, well, I can see the shape of it. Ah, it's going to be the hurdles. Oh, nice. Nice. Have you ever used these? You see these a lot in training videos that go viral online, on Instagram. 
and they're really, really good for training. And again, I always wanted these and never had them. So I ordered six, because I don't want to be going easy on myself. Trust me, do a minute or two doing yeah, jump. That does your calves, man. Ah, quads, calves, hammies, all gone. <laughs> don't, you, don't you know what you ordered? <laughs> I, forgot, I forgot what I ordered. Here we go, cut. I know what it is as well, because it says on the back. Aha. Okay. Uh, what is this? So this is a rebound board. If you haven't got a training partner, you haven't always got someone to pass the ball to you. So that's where these rebound boards come in really handy. You've just got these things that just open out and it's done. Ready to go. We're nearly there. We've only got a few boxes left. Here we go. And here we have, you guys guess what it is yet? Boom! A rebound board. You've just got holes here. You can lift this and you can close it or open it as much as you want and it just drops down into one of the holes. We've got a rebound board. Last box. We're down to the final box. What's it gonna be inside? Here we go. Oh, the corner thing. The top corner. Oh, that's so oh, good. good. These things are brilliant. They look so good on camera. That'll go down there. Job done. We've got your top corner target. Two of those as well. We don't want to discriminate against the left top pins. So we've got one for the left and one for the right. It's all about equality here. <laughs> so that's both top corners done. We've got a top corner target in the left hand side and a top corner target in the right hand side. I'm telling you, some damage is going to be done when it comes to those top pins. You know it's coming as well. Trust me on that. And finally, the last thing that I ordered from Networld Sports is... Ah. There's a billion targets on that thing. <laughs> yeah, there are. Oh my gosh. Um, I thought this was the one with just top, top corners and bottom corners. But it's lovely to it. Looks too big. Okay, this is definitely the wrong one. <laughs> I thought this was going to be the, um, you know, the Forza targets where you can see the top corners and the bottom corners. You, they use them at a lot of pro training grounds. Um, I think I've made a mistake on the order there. That's definitely not what I was ordering. It's still cool, but it's not what I wanted. So I'll probably return that and reorder it. That's it guys. That is what a thousand pounds gets you in training equipment. I'm really happy with it. I cannot wait to get it all set up and start making football videos uh, for you guys to enjoy. So that's it for this video. But in the next video, I'm gonna actually give you guys what you've been asking for, which is for me to actually do a session in the garden, film it and post it for you guys to see. So my first ever proper training session in this garden on this pitch, don't worry, you're not gonna miss it. I'm gonna film it and post it as a video. And then it's gonna be this one. She's got the call up. It's gonna be football challenges versus my sister. So that's it guys, as always, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, thank you so much if you've subscribed. If you haven't already, make sure you turn on your notifications because like I always say, YouTube's pushing out my shorts, but my longer form videos, they might not get recommended to you unless you've got your notifications turned on. So make sure you turn them on so you don't miss a thing. Oh yeah, and we passed half a million subscribers as well. Guys, I cannot thank you enough, man. The channel's growing so fast and it's down to you guys sharing the content, engaging with it, leaving comments and watching it till the end as well. So many of you guys are watching the videos from start to finish and that really helps me out so I'll keep creating content for you guys to enjoy and all I want you to do is just keep watching it and enjoying it and like I said I read every comment and I just want to extend my gratitude to all you guys for your positive energy you guys give me life and I'm super excited about the banging content that I'm gonna create using this garden we've got everything we need now we've got the goal we've got the net we've got the turf and now we've got the training equipment next up you know what's coming it's gonna be the first ever football video in my back garden as always I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one trust me things are about to get absolutely savage in this garden let's go